You don't see that every day. <laughs> That's so cool. We all got to see as a family. That's something that we couldn't have done anywhere else in any other way. As a filmmaker, I document our family adventures in Alaska. After our daughter Ava was diagnosed with a fatal genetic disease, our adventures came to a halt. The greatest memories we have together are those made outside. Every family should have the same opportunity. Tris and I met in college. We started rock climbing and hiking together. We got married after college, had Atticus. And then shortly thereafter, we decided we might as well have them all. So we had Tess and Ren. So we got, you know, six, eight, and 10. And then we thought we were done. <laughs> and had a little uh, surprise <laughs> named Coda. He is almost three. We found out in utero that he had Down syndrome and a very large hole in his heart. He had kind of an explosion of lots of medical complications. At first they thought his liver was bad. We had to go to Seattle Children's for that one. Then his heart crumped out, so we ended up having a heart surgery. In addition to Down syndrome, he got diagnosed with cerebral palsy. I think as an infant, his first year of life was pretty um, difficult. When they were young, we did Spencer Glacier because you can push a stroller all the way out and camp out in the backwoods. Just going up somewhere where you can drive a car up and then walk a little ways off and feel like you're in the middle of nowhere. We like that feeling, but it's, it's obviously been hard to get with our family. Despite those challenges, how can we still do the things that we want to do? That's something I think about. It's something I've never seen before. I've never seen bears in the wild. I was excited as they were, probably a little more. <laughs> Did you want to do the book again? You know, we've always looked online, seen some of the crazy pictures of the bears, kind of just thought, you know, we've been here this long, why haven't we done it? We got on and fought for seats, figured out where everyone was gonna sit. We've never been on a small plane before, so to be in one is pretty cool. I'd never been on one before, and it was yeah, cool and to fly. it was fun, fun. The outgoing tide is making these really cool patterns in the silt. I really liked it because I could look out the window and see all the things below. <laughs> Me too. As we were flying in, we were landing to the left of us, there was a mother and a couple cubs. We told Jessica pretty quick. Hi, Coda. Hi. See the mom and the two babies, and there's a big bear coming to the left. For the kids, it's a really great thing because, I mean, you're sitting and watching these bears just kind of doing what they do. 
So if you throw a camera in there with them, then they're able to start looking at it a different way. Found another bear trying to fish. The kids dubbed him Fisher, and he was super fun to watch. Is he two years old? He's big. No, he's probably more like five or six. Fisher was trying to catch a fish, and he couldn't. He'd see him zone in, and then he'd pounce on these fish and come up with nothing. <laughs> time and time again. With a something in the water, I can feel it in my bones. Come on. It's in It's in the water. It's splashing. <laughs> Coda, yeah, Coda. You tell him. Watch him pounce. I feel bad that he's not getting it. He will. There's a lot of fish here. It's really good practice for him. When you go out in the wilderness, which is where we would want to take a family photo, there's always a kid that's crying or hungry or cold. It's a lot of work. We are uh, delivering the print for the Gorski family and the teaser for their adventure. I'm excited, but I'm kind of nervous. I mean, I can't imagine that they'd hate it, but you never know. Hey, hey. How's it going? Good to see ya. Awesome. For your request. I know, I'm so excited. The fact that Dan was able to like capture a picture of us and we're all mostly smiling and looking at the camera is something we don't have. My family's been asking for years for a family picture. <laughs> so I finally have one. And I have one for our own wall, which that's the best. pretty awesome. I was really glad that we all got to see as a family. Being out in the wild with my family, that's something that you couldn't have done anywhere else in any other way. Yeah.